Welcome to RHN, the Radical Happenings Network. Woo! I draw all my inspiration from the CHN, or where I get all my information. Shout out to Shadow, Meow Meow, uh, Potluck Larry, whoever your name is, Luke Perry, whatever. You know your name. I don't know really what it is. I want to say Amelia Estevez, but I don't know him, and he might be passed on. Anyway, this is a comedy special. Boom! Mic drop. Whoa! Yo, that's a phallic joke. Whoa! Anyway, you, you wouldn't touch a hot mic, would you? Yo, mama did. Yes, that's the kind of quality you can get from Radical Happiness Network when I Captain Morgan all up in your derriere. And I'm like, yo, I'm funny, bitch. And then they go, well, what's, what's happening? And I go, that was a TV show. And then they're like, use the mic. That was a TV show. Rerun? And shit like that, right? I think so. That was a big dude. You know, I mean, my role models, I had J.J. Walker. I had Bill Cosby. Eddie Murphy. Huh. I don't know if these people are cool anymore. Now, I mean, I had the Deja Bill. Like, as far as, like, cool people. You know, but before them, for me, it was like that. Who were those comedy people? The King of the Comedy. Yeah, they were pretty cool. I don't know, man. Something weird's happening, though. I don't know how everybody be raping everybody. I'm just like, you know, this is a comedy special. Um, I was supposed to make light of the situation, but shit real in these comedic streets, yo. I be writing myself in the corners. I be looking around for unidentified chemtrails and shit. I don't know. You know, you got to... Well, gee, scary, folks. Like, I, I got 2G and barely enough wood for your mama. I'm just saying, you know, I do the best I can with what I got. And what I got is happening. What's happening? Hey, hey, hey. Now, why am I going in this line of thought? Well, eh, why not? Who else wears a Hawaiian shirt with this? This is probably some kind of acceptable now. Like this? This is probably like, look at this. See these muscles? I got them. You want them? Yo. Kill them. These are my muscles. I work hard for them. Now, let me get a little bit up close with you. All right. Now, with all this awesome stuff that I provide you, oh, you mean the happenings. What's going on right now? Well, you yeah, know, right now, I'll shout out CHN. They're going to try something on Hyperboreans. I don't know shit. I'm trying to learn about the reverbs. I don't know anything about them. But sounds kind of like Lord of the Rings type shit. I don't know. I ain't, I ain't read Lord of the Rings. I ain't, I ain't read no J.R.R. Tolkien. I, I tried to read the Bilbo Baggins book where a nigger was riding that barrel for a fucking mile and then the, the Hobbits had hairy feet or some stupid shit. Man, fuck them books. I'm just saying, I ain't read them, so, you know, except for that part where it was his name, Bilbo fucking Baggins, that's the damn name. Fuck him. And his little precious. Fuck him. And those Harry Potter wands. I would say fuck them, but I've seen some wand commercials that are horrible. So there was this one I saw as a toy. It had like it was a flower, and he'd buy a Dollar Tree or some shit like that, and it played eerie music, and it had a scary witch mask on the other side, and it was like ooh spooky. Like we just uh, yeah, we took some Halloween stock, splashed the fucking mirror on it or some shit, and now here you go, baby plays with this. Ah, baby's first possessed toy, and that's what I go and say. Demonic toys. Shout out to ODB and uh, Full Moon. Uh, like, the lady B was like that, I was like, oh shit, that motherfucker might see some demonic toys. And it was all like, that's the, ah! <laughs> and I'm like, the fuck, aren't you the same dude that stole, stole those sneakers from Snicker Stadium, the same place I got my shoes from? You come up in here, Virginia, and steal your sneakers from Snicker Stadium? Oh, and I was locked up with a motherfucker, what's his name? Chris Brown? He beat Rihanna or some shit, oh, Virginia? Everybody on the board, they were like, you know, Chris Brown's here. I'm like, I don't give a fuck. What's a Chris Brown? I found out. The news told me what a Chris Brown was. Chris Black and Blue. That's what I think he should be called. But, you know, hey, it's what it is. You know, he came back and made that that hit song. I don't know. I'm driving it. That motherfucker. Yeah, I thought he was supposed to be like the next Freddie Michael Jackson or some shit. Like, I don't know. I don't want to even talk about Michael no more, huh? I, I don't even know what to think no more. So we ain't we ain't gonna we ain't gonna do that. 
Oh, and George Bush is in the news. I like both of them. What about Jeb Bush? What's he do? I don't know. Uh, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> like if I was in a politics, I wouldn't have fell asleep in government class. Sorry, Mr. Parker. That shit sucked. That extra credit was the worst extra credit. You go to a town hall meeting. Extra credit. Try to stay awake. All right. And I was like, yo, this is a town hall meeting? This is a sucking. All these people got horrible ideas. And they were like, I propose to uh, build three chicken houses so I can raise a bunch of chickens out in Chesapeake. I'm like, nigga, what? And they're like, yeah, chicken in Chesapeake. We are. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? Seriously. You're talking to a guy that, like, when I came up, I, uh, we, we left the trailer park, Cardinal State. You know, that's where I came up. I was five. I started skateboarding. But I had a park right next to it. Oh, man, it was awesome. Trailer park out in Cardinal State. It's pretty awesome. And then, uh, I, you know, I had a, uh, <laughs> oh, man, I got, okay, check this out. So I lived there, right? And then my, uh, my mom worked for his uh, lady, uh, Marion. Marion, she was Hamburg or whatnot. Marion Hamburg and her, uh, her husband. They're cool people. Like, his husband was from Norway. His Hamburg was, like, from Germany or um, up east, up home, Rhode Island or something. New England type shit. I don't know. But, any which way. She gave me, a, uh, she lived in the same uh, neighborhood, but she took our trailer later, and it was pretty cool. But we moved out to the house. And, um, yeah, so, uh, she was a big girl. Oh, man. Like, who, and, and, and the Norway dude, it was crocheted and shit that he was in there. Yeah, it was pretty cool. It was, was kind of like a tell off. And it was awesome. And then my, uh, like, my, uh, Aunt Jackie and, my, uh, my cousin Kenneth and, um, my cousin, uh, what's his name? Really? I don't see him, but Brian. Yeah, they, they uh, lived in the RV with my, uh, my cousin, like, in a trailer park, and they got a park. And we were young, and it was, like, Christmas time came around. Like, I committed a sin. I didn't know. I got in trouble. But not for this one. I, like, you know, I thought I was like five, you know, and I'm like, you know, and my parents and and my mom's sister used to uh, put presents unwrapped, you know. And I was like, well, if Santa Claus is real, right? Then that motherfucker won't mind if I take one of his presents and put it in my pile. <laughs> and so that's what I was talking my little brain thought. And I was like, I want this fluorescent fucking, this was like, it was like neon motherfucking <laughs> uh, pink handle. Uh, and a green blade butterfly knife. So I was on the ninja stuff. I had the ninja stars, you know, and I got the Rambo shit, like the, the shooting gun with the missile. Oh man, it was awesome. Yeah, but I, I took that. <laughs> Nobody said anything because they didn't know. But it was pretty cool. And also back then, I, I put my first dip of skull in my mouth. They had they came out with pouches, right? And I was up on this hippie hot frog thing, and I was trying to chew a skull pouch, and I uh, bit my teeth, and then I got. Like, I swallowed the back, and I spit up everywhere, and I was like, fucking, what, five, seven, or was it, no, five and seven, okay, I don't know, man, I did elementary books, man, uh, Holland Elementary, Plaza Elementary, that's, uh, one of them goes, one is five, I'm not sure which one, but, but anyway, and then I moved out to the house, and then we had a fucking little uh, miniature horse named Coco, man, I had to, like, trade it, some dude, like, a Mustang we were restoring, as a father or something, and then I got a miniature donkey. No, I don't know, not a miniature horse named Coco. And it used to shit all in the fucking. We were keeping it. it was, they had a pressure washer business back then, and it, uh, like we made a wrap to go over the do, uh, the little um, horse, and a beach on pressure washing, and it was, it was dope. Um, and it was a good time because we also had uh, we go in Halloween trick or treating with the. Fucking little miniature horse and shit. And that was when I realized you can barter. Like, we worked real hard. And we traded this motherfucker in the Mustang. And I got a miniature horse. And these bunny rabbits. And these fucking, we got turkeys. And we got fucking chickens. Oh, my God. It was neat. In the suburbs. Like, the, the fucking early 90s, you know, suburbs. Like, that kind of look before, um, shit kind of, we had to move. <laughs> yeah. The business failed. It was like... EPA came down and shit and fucking fucked up the the shit. Fucked everything up. My grandpa didn't help. But anyway. <laughs> it happened. Uh, this was the guy's first one. Now it's a, a tell-all book on the radness. The man who dares to be cool when being cool. 
isn't cool. I tell you now. Now, on, on to Jesus. How, how many people be hating on Jesus? Show hands. Y'all are going to hell. Yeah. Atheists, Linux, using niggas, y'all going to hell. I mean, see, I ain't going to dark niggas. I know you going to hell. Oh, you going somewhere. You, you got to get the fuck up out of here, fine people. You hear what I'm saying? You know what I'm putting down. Fight for what's right. And try to get a six pack like mine. Okay, I need to do some ab crunches and some push ups. Now, let to be a lesson to you. You ain't got guns to steal. I mean, unless you do, and then, boom, you got backups. No, man, these are my guns. Look, Bob, you can't handle the guns. So, we gotta take them away from you. No, no, I'm pretty sure I'll say that in the Constitution. No, look there. If you teach you some lies and you expect me to believe them, and I believe them, then you the one that's in the wrong. I know this is crazy, but you can't blame me for being stupid if you taught me how to be stupid. So go fuck yourself. I'm just saying, like, nigga, please. Like, I'm the best comedian you've ever seen. And he threatens you because I'm all like, how are you doing? And he's like, I'm not doing so good since you came here, Ricky. You are an asshole. I'm like, well, thank you. I play an asshole in real life, so I got a lot of experience. Now, um, we were talking about the Radical Happenings Network. I was. So if you want to join, you'll get a free newsletter uh, via video post. You'll get like a free, like you join the Radical Happenings Network like every day. Something be happening in my life. So I'm going to be telling you about it. So maybe it be a long ass story like this one. Or maybe I'll just be like, yo, how's your mama doing? And then you'll be like, I told you I'd get you my two, yeah, yeah, two YP pillowcases. They're mine now. Now that is my catchphrase. Now I'll put that on your 2D wife with pillowcases and you can just, you know, cuddle up next to this. You know, for Christmas. Just saying. Oh, okay, okay. I just, I just stepped on that. You don't want to mess with ninjas. We do it all night long, honey. No, um, that, this is a comedy special that might not have been funny. Um, uh, I thought it was, <laughs> and so, you know, sit and spin. Um, I, I hate to be boring Master Shake so much, but I owe most of my comedy to him, and his comically oversized chair. So let's get a hand for this comically oversized chair over here. Yeah, it's a ride in variety hour. Just suck my dick. No, I'm just kidding. Let's, don't do that. Uh, I mean, do do that if that's what you're into, but the fact of the matter is, right now, I need to get this camera over here and share my comically huge chair, which is already in progress. Alright, so, I like how I'm dedicating that thick-ass mic skill to... Look at this. Watch this. That's gonna be me. I'm just sitting right here. See that big ass chair? Or not? Big, yeah, it's a big ass chair. I, I'm a little dude. Uh, big ass chair, little dude. That's really funny. Classic comedy. Like, I think fucking Mary Antoinette did this. Oh, I'm Mary Antoinette. What's her digit? No, 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 woman's name. What's her name? We're not Rue McClanahan. That woman. That other woman. That's not Rue McClanahan. I know more women than Rue McClanahan. God damn it, I know this. Why in the fuck would I want to say that eight billion times? Ruby Conahan, you're a stud boy. It's here. I'm here, man. Where's the scenes of your problem? Between my legs, Taylor. All right. No. <laughs> uh, what do I... Yeah, that's wrong. Uh, you should not never let your kids watch Golden Girls unattended. Things may end up uh, not in St. Olaf, as they would say. I ain't said that word in a while. Not St. Olaf. I wonder if that's a real thing. That's Oh, nigga, what happened? Oh, hey, I fought on? I said record? I'm oh, sorry about that. Um, that means drop my audience, you know? Ugh. Uh, yo, hit that like and subscribe button. I heard you got you got to say that a lot. So hit that like and subscribe button if you want more content like this. Um, we're going to get on to the cool shit. Are we going to fuck around? You know, we're going to have to. That's my fault. I, I like to fuck around a little bit, you know, but at the end of the day, it's comically oversized chair. Does it fit? Okay, 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 hold up. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Show the product. Central Happening Network. Go visit that. Ugh. Tell them, you know, have a great day. And you love them. That's what happening. Network. Alright. Yeah. I'm just kidding about Radical Happenings Network. This is just a comedy special. But this right here. Uh, I was, hey, here's a piece of art update. I colored it with the paint. And so I'm going to work on that. 
You know, it's not, I got other things to do. Like, I got to watch videos on YouTube. You know, I got to research my competition. And so far, I'm way behind in the polls. I'm trying to work on that. So, Polish people, you guys give a thumbs up in my video if you can. If you can't, then I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to pretend like you did anyway. So, have a nice day. I'm a nice man. I'm going to run for president one day. It's going to be awesome. I'm going to get elected, and it's going to be awesome. And I'm going to be like, yo, I ain't, I ain't really going to try that again. Oh, good okay, chair on top of chair technology. We haven't got that far yet. I guess two of you still work on them robot chairs. Ain't that right, boy? All right. So I know you've been wanting some some good loving, yeah, and that that's it shows. But fear not. Like, what if you know? I wanted to be the coolest person your mama's ever met. How would I get in them hands? Just ask. Um, a lot of people ask me these questions, and I go, hey, you got to say it from the heart and mean it, because you, you better trust your gut reaction. I had a couple gut reactions that I should have, you know, did not have uh, gone against, and every time I get fucked up, so, I come to the conclusions. If your body's telling you something, you better listen. I'm just saying. Like, if you don't think I'm funny, then, you know, go to hell, I guess. Fuck you. Uh, that's what Terry would say. I like him. If you don't know who Terry is, check out Terry Davis. Uh, rest in peace. I believe I talked to him on the internet at one time. He was awesome. Uh, for a situation, he was a very happy person. Ugh. So, that's why I got kind of pissed off, man. Shit. Making drum videos of Terry, motherfuckers talking about, yo, you gonna do a Terry video? Oh, you gonna be like, man, rest in peace, motherfucker. I mean, what am I supposed to say? I hope it was sore and painless when... I don't really know what happened, and it sounds fishy, and, you know, it kind of scares me. But I don't. I believe uh, Terry is a warrior, so. Like, and if your whole belief system is based on beliefs, that means if you believe it to be true, then it is true. That's manifest energy, and a power in the right direction. And the Bible talks about this plenty of places. Believe it, and you shall receive it. Believe in God's blessings, and boom, he'll get you. But don't, like I have it sometimes. I mean, I'm negative Nancy. I think I was born into being fucking negative. But anyway, a negative world builds a negative person. I mean, it's equally stupid. Like government and shit. But hey, this is a radical happening network where we make our cigarettes. Oh, on the fly. This comedy's on the fly. Well, you, you don't like comedy? Yeah, I work hard. So I can bring you this. Let's take. Yo, this is for sale. It's got a whole bunch of stuff on it. It's like, it's got your, your mama's titty jokes on it. I, I took them at the VHS. This is a one-on-one. Y'all might want to get this one day. It's got hand-done artwork by me. Because I'm cool like that, you know. It comes with a yeah, hand-done sticker. Yeah, this is a, the radness, you know. Got some stickers on there. What's the stickers on there? I did good. You know, this is a barcode that says, fuck you. Yeah, the market abuse and shit, IBM type shit, man. I ain't a conspiracy theorist. Well, I know some niggas need to suck my dick because I don't like them. And they glow in the dark. Yo, yo, that right there is Snoopy and Africa Fog. That's uh, pretty cool. You get that with a DVD. Not really a fog, I guess it's like a, a milk cap or some shit. And, uh, oh, nigga, what? Oh, yeah, this is, this is a rare production photo. This is a, see, you get a high 18. That I use to uh, record on uh, package because that's probably weird or some shit. Stupid people like that type of shit. Oh, it's Pirates! Bitch. Whatever. You know, this here comes complete with original coffee stain. It's a, it's a time stamp. Oh, uh, this is. I actually like did a sketch for and shit. And there they're all testing the markers and shit like that. People like this type of shit. I don't know. I see, see shit like this, like. Like ten years down the road, I got the fan art for the motherfucking redness. It came in the yeah, get it, copy it, <laughs> make tons of them, give them out to your friends. One person buy that bitch up, and then and then after that, I recuperate all my cost. Hell, I might even turn my telephone on, start my own calling radio show. Oh, it's the redness. Yeah, R H L M N O P Q R D's nuts. And you'd be like, damn, long ass. Did I spell that? 
Her, spe her spell checks just keep coming off. Basically, these nuts. I don't know, man. I think life's too short to be bitter. And. But sometimes I also say, fuck the world. So, you know, it is that. Some say, what, is that duality? You have to be. I don't think anybody can be like, super positive all the time. I mean, you gotta be real monk status and that type of shit. Like, I'm trying. That shit hard. It's called uh, true enlightenment or self actualization or some shit. And, you know, if you're gonna say you're self actualized, you might not be there. You know, that's the old saying I used to hear. But, alright, my mama told me that. Oh, no, she's not. I, I told myself that. Uh, and oh, I said this too once. Because something ain't what it seems. Because nobody bought a mixtape. I know I got 38 subscribers now, 39, and it just keeps rising. You know this this motherfucking mixtape is gonna be packed full of stuff you can't see on the YouTube, like some Japanese titties where I do the music on the piano. I make a little, I make a titty bounce. Look, don't worry about it. She was not harmed during the filming of that. I hope. <sighs> The state of the world scares me sometimes because people are stupid. Like, not all of them, but most of the ones I've met that try to engage me in conversation um, that were dumb really pissed me off. I, it might be a lot of you. I don't know. You know, I know there's a lot of smart people in this world, but damn, some of y'all are dumb. Topic of judging people. You got on their appearance. It's just... Anyway, that's been a radical. Let me try some of mixtape. Boom, special where I talk to you about. I don't know buy this mixtape. Somebody gotta do it, man. Shit. Oh, I was gonna play some drums. Maybe I should make a separate drum. No, I sat down to play the drums. I fell off the chair. Y'all, y'all remember seeing me fall off that damn chair? That shit. I don't know, man. Y'all got short tennis, man. Uh, so. Uh, take out the chopsticks before it's too late. Oh, it's not dirty on the design. Alright, y'all on a funky beat? Y'all on a funky beat? Oh, hold up. No! That's why you lose chopper sticks that way. Lose so many chopper sticks by forgetting where you're at. Alright. Put this drum in the book right here. Oh, we're gonna get comfy up in this bitch. No, right up I have the network. Shout out to, uh, Elijah Sampler. I don't know who the fuck that is. He sounds nice. If it is a guy. I don't know. I haven't seen him successful, so I don't know. Uh, anyway. You might be hyped up on all that male vitality stuff. Uh, let's do this. Uh. for Terry Davis. Woo! Uh, yes, yes. And the uh, spirit of the man. The myth, the legend, the one I like to call my friend on this uh, comedy special.
try not to see it again. Recovering my man Terry, I just hope he's covered. I think. Random. Boom. All right. Jeremiah 31. Indeed, I heard Ephraim pleading, You disciplined me, and I took the discipline. I was like a calf untrained. Bring me back. Let me come back. For you are the Lord my God. For after I had turned away, I repented. And after I was discovered, I struck my thigh. I was ashamed and I was dismayed because I bore the disgrace of my youth. Boom. Fear not. In my religion, there's an injured Jesus coming. And he's going to injure every fucking thing. I don't know. Tax shelter. My, my, you know. He's going to be, be my supporter. And give us a tax free uh, church of the injured Jesus coming soon. Write my own damn Bible. But whatever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But you damn sure I some ninja Jesus in my Bible. It'd be badass like a He-Man ninja. Oh. <laughs> they ain't laughing at me, so I love the Jesus. Alright. <laughs> be strong. Stay Christian. And love your brother as yourself.